Hello, good morning. It's Wednesday the 16th. I'm FX Plue and this is a rather grotty market brief. Um, so, yeah, we had the uh, UK employment data out yesterday. Uh, the good news was that unemployment, all the benefits, uh, benefits claims, fell to just shy of 32,000 in January. Uh, the bad news was that the December number was revised up 8,000 to uh, 51.6 thousand. Um, the raw numbers aren't as important as the trend and that is showing a degree of tightness in the labour market. Um, while wages are beginning to pick up, they are comfortably below the rate of inflation for the time being. Today we do have inflation data for January. Year-on-year uh, -year inflation is forecast to remain unchanged at 5.4%, while month-on-month -month, uh, may fall slightly, which would be good news for the Bank of England. A word to the wise, though. Uh, the prospect of further rate hikes is providing some support for sterling at the moment. So, if the data suggests that the pace or indeed the size of future rate hikes uh, could be reduced, then we may see that really pull the rug from under the pound. Watch out if you're a currency buyer. Yesterday, sterling uh, remained within the recent range. Uh, we opened around 135.50 against the dollar and 119.30 against the euro. Um, over in the US, Powell's second term is being slightly delayed by a dispute in Congress. Uh, that is over the appointment of the new Fed Oversight Representative. Pithy title. Um, I'm sure it'll all get ironed out soon enough, but as it's the Republicans currently blocking the appointment, poor old Powell may feel he has very few friends on Capitol Hill right now. Um, we've got retail sales data uh, due out later today in the US. Uh, the record inflation is not expected to show uh, consumers are retreating from the shops just yet. Following a disappointing number in December, forecasts are for a 2% rise in January. Uh, there's always a chance that things may jolt the market with a uh, surprise on either side of forecast, but for now the dollar index is lacking any real kind of impetus. Um, it's still a couple of weeks uh, before the February uh, payrolls data, so further trading is expected to be range bound for the time being. Um, yesterday we fell to a low of 95.95 uh, um, for the dollar index, and uh, a euro dollar, well, that kicks off this morning about 113.60. Right then, that's it from me. Have a great day. Join me again tomorrow. If you do not have a clue, then just tweet through and ask FX Blue.